It occurred to me this week that not listening to someone is a sure way of saying, I don't love you, or I'm not interested in you, or I don't think you have much to say that is worth hearing. But sadly and incredibly, that is what we often do to God. We don't listen to his word, and sometimes we don't want to listen to his word, because we believe that our own way of doing life will be better than his. Well, that kind of attitude to God and his word is what the Bible calls sin. Wonderfully, though, if we have ears to hear, God graciously tells us in his word how we can come back to him and be forgiven. It's through faith in Jesus. Well, if, like me, you are aware of ways that you have not been listening to God lately, even today, perhaps, doing something that you know is contrary to his word, then do join with me in the words of confession that are coming up on your screen now. We say together, Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in what we've thought, said and done. Because of Jesus, please forgive us all that we have done wrong and help us to love and serve you to the glory of your name. Amen. As God's forgiven people, let us now join together in the words of the Christian family prayer which Jesus taught his followers to pray. We say together, Our Father in heaven, may your name be honoured. May your kingdom come and your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today the things we need and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Let us not give in to temptation and protect us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Well, after our next song, Johnny is going to lead us in prayer. But before that, we're going to sing an old favourite of many. Let's stand to praise and worship God in the words of Bless the Lord, O my soul. <laughs> 